And right? I'm positive on flying. But 10 hours is too much. It's too much. 10 hours, right? I'm going, it's too much. And then I start to feel like a bit of a baby. Because I'm going, well, the first people who came here from England, you know, to Vancouver, the first people who came here, they spent six weeks on a boat. And they ended up in like Halifax or something, you know. And they walked the rest of the way. They're like, most of it with another boat on their shoulder, you know. Oh, we there yet? No, no trees, keep walking. No wonder nobody lives here, there's no shops. So, I'm thinking, well, relative to that, this is a pretty good gig, 10 hours on a plane, you know? But I'm still thinking to myself, well, I still want to avoid it, so this is, I'm a millennial chap. I will simply medicate myself to avoid the voyage, right? You know? I have the power. I will simply fall asleep. I will take the little blue pill and kaboom, I'm done, you know? Not that little blue pill. There's always somebody. There's always somebody who's like, no. No, no, no. I don't want to spend 10 hours on a plane like that, thank you. My tree table is up. No. No, no. No, no, I take a sleeping pill. But the problem is, when you take a sleeping pill, sleeping pill sleep is not normal sleep. It's not peaceful, restful, you know, tranquil sleep. It's not, the, it's not like the, the falling of the feather when you fall asleep. Oh, it's getting dark. I, I feel so tired. And... You know, it's not like that, you know. Sleeping pill sleep is more like, like, like a baby being thrown into a well or something. It's just, ah, black, you know. And conversely, when you wake up, it's the same hideousness in reverse, you know. Like normal sleeping, like normal waking up is kind of pleasant, you know. It's like, what are those birds? You know, like, oh, oh it's another day, oh, you know. And, but when you wake up from sleeping pill sleep, it's just like, it's like, like, it's like being birthed or something. You know, and, 